Lord God, blessed be your name. Greetings in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, our Lord. We are pleased to welcome you today to our service. Ephesians 6 and verse 18 reminds us as follows. Finally, my brethren, be strong in the Lord and in the power of his might. Put on the whole armor of God that ye may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil. Today, I want to encourage each and every one of us to live victorious through Jesus Christ, our Lord. I therefore entreat those who are baptized in Jesus' name and receive the baptism of the Holy Spirit to remain firm in your walk with God. And those who are yet to begin this life-changing walk with Jesus Christ today, for those online, please call or text 876-806-4418 so that we can reach out to you with this life-changing gospel. We wish to specially remind those who want to walk this pathway that our Lord Jesus Christ still loves you. We have been praying for you and we stand ready to help you return. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. So be blessed as you join us in worship today in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Oh, we bless your name. Hallelujah. We bless your name. Hallelujah. 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 We bless Jesus. you. Blessed be your name, Lord. Hallelujah. At the highest place for you are the great high priest. We place you.
Aleluya, 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 aleluya. Every 
chain, break every chain, break every chain. To break every chain, break every chain, break every chain. To break every chain, break every chain, break every chain. Oh, 
Jesus. Praise the Lord. Yes, when we send up the praise, it's like this is precious Satan. Some of we might not have no food, but we are precious Satan. We don't have no money, but we are precious Satan. Pressure with your prayers. Pressure with your prayers. Hallelujah. Pressure with your prayers. Yes. Glory to God. Hallelujah. 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 Glory to God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Glory to God. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Glory to God. Glory to God. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Bless your name, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. You're worthy. You're worthy. Thank you, Jesus. You're worthy, God. You're worthy. Hallelujah. You're worthy, Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Have your way, Lord. If you have a praise offering, just give it. Hallelujah. If you have a praise offering, just give it. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Because you care, because you care, because you care, you care, you care, you you care, you you care, you Thank you, Jesus. 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 We worship you. Glory to God. Hallelujah. We worship you. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Hallelujah. Give him a praise offering. Give him a praise offering. Hallelujah. Precious Satan. Precious Satan with your prayers. Hallelujah. Precious Satan with your prayers. Woo. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Glory to God. Praise the name of the Lord. We are going to sing from the Pentecostal in our opening hymn. Oh, I want to see him. Hallelujah. If you know how much pressure we put the devil on when we praise, we would give him some more. The truth is that he expects some of us to be crying today. So give God a praise and put the pressure on. We have situations to make us cry, but we're going to pray. We're going to praise, we're going to praise, we're going to praise, hallelujah, hallelujah, oh yes, hallelujah, 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 thank you Jesus, hallelujah, there is a reason to praise our God, hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. hallelujah. You want to put the devil under some more pressure? Come, we give some more praise. Give some more praise. Pressure the enemy with your praise. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Pressure the enemy with your praise. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Glory to God, glory to God, glory to God, glory to God. Glory, thank hallelujah, hallelujah. Thank you, hallelujah, thank hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, thank you Jesus. Jesus. Glory to God. Bless your name, holy thank God. You, Bless your name, holy God. Praise Bless the name, name of holy the Lord. God. Thank Praise you, Jesus. Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Praise the name of the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Lord, you're worthy. Lord, you're worthy. Hallelujah. Lord, you're worthy. He's worthy. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He's worthy. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, I want to see him. Hallelujah. As Hallelujah. I journey through the land, singing as I go, pointing souls to Calvary, to the crimson flow. Many arrows, many arrows pierce my soul from, from without, without within. within. Oh, but my Lord. Lead me on and do him I must say. Oh, I want to see him to look upon his face. There to sing forever of his saving grace. On the streets of glory, they will lift my voice. When tears are past, and I'll be home. Oh 
Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We continue worshiping this morning with the reading of the scripture. As it comes from Ecclesiastes 11, and we'll read it together. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. When the phone is given, amen. Hallelujah. So let's begin. Hallelujah. Cast thy bread upon the waters. For thou shalt find it after many days. Give a portion to seven, and a last to eight. For thou knowest that what evil shall be upon the herd. 
the clouds be full of rains. In the place where the tree falleth, there it shall be. He that observeth the wind shall not so, but he that as thou knowest not what is the way, in the morning sow thy seed, and in the evening withhold not thine hand, for thou knowest not whether it shall prosper, either this or that, or whether they both shall be alike. Truly the light and a pleasant thing it is for the eyes to behold the sun. But if a man live many years and rejoice, for they shall be many, all that cometh is vanity. Rejoice, O young man, in thy youth, and let thy heart cheer thee in the days of thy youth. And walk in the ways of thine heart, and in the sight of thine hand. But know thou that for all these things God will bring thee into judgment. Therefore, remove sorrow from thine heart, and put away from thy flesh. For childhood and youth are vanity. Amen. This is the word of God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thanks be to God. Thank you, Jesus. Bless the Lord. At this time, Sister Charlotte Graham is coming for the morning's greeting. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Bless the Lord, everybody. Bless the Lord. Greetings in the exalted name of Jesus Christ, our soon and coming King. It's a privilege to be in the house of the Lord one more time. And uh, we are indeed grateful to our visitors that are here today worshiping the Lord with us. On behalf of our pastor, Andrew Mitchell, in his absence, we want to welcome you as well as, or on behalf of our assistant pastor, Eunice Mitchell, and the saints of the First United Pentecostal Church of Highgate, we do welcome you here today. I'm going to be calling your names and you may stand and shout a hallelujah or you may sit and shout a hallelujah just the same. Bless the Lord Jesus. We have from siding Miss Monica Daly. Hallelujah. Bless the name of Jesus. <clears throat> we have Shanique Malcolm from Trimosworth. Thank you, Jesus. We have Odette Gardner. And our two children, Teja, Teja named Martin and Tejan Martin. Bless the Lord. And they're all from Siding. We have Russia Lee O'Connor from Harmony All. Anthony Lewis from Harmony All. Aidan Baker and Kavina Baker from Harmony All. And also Tony and Abduli from Harmony All. And if there's any I miss, I want to give the Lord thanks that you're here. I also want to identify Sister, Ta Sister Tracy Campbell and Brother Ensworth Campbell. The Lord bless you richly. Bless the Lord. Bless the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Could I just ask all the saints to stand? We're going to give the visitors a round of applause for being in the house of the Lord today. Because guess what? They're in the right place at the right time because the presence of the Lord is here. And whatever their needs are, God can fulfill it. We are indeed happy that you took the time out to worship the Lord 
with us today. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. At this time, we are going to collect the morning's tithes and offering. Ushers, please come. Elder Campbell, we're inviting you to come and bless the offering for us. Elder Campbell, thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise God, everybody. Praise God. Just want to give God thanks for today. Praise God. Hallelujah. Thank Him for life. Thank you, Jesus. And as they're about to call a court, tithe, and offering, I'm going to ask God to bless it. Father in heaven, as they're about to call a court, tithe, and offering today, Lord, we ask you to bless, bless everyone. That's church for to give. God, and those that have not to give, that you will provide. Lord, that in due season, Lord, they will have to give unto thy work. In Jesus' precious name. Ushers. You are the word at the beginning, one with God, the Lord Most High. Your hidden glory in creation.
hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. What a powerful name. The name of Jesus Christ, our King. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. At this time, we're going into a period of worship and testimony. We're inviting Sister McCoy to come back to the mic. What a beautiful name it is. What a beautiful name it is. The name of Jesus Christ, my name. Name it is the name of Jesus. There is no honor. There If you have a burning, Thank spectacular you. testimony, give it first. <laughs> then the other testimony. If you have a spectacular testimony that God has done something special for you and you want to share it. This side first. Bless the Lord. the Lord. Praise God is a healer. Hallelujah. Give the Lord a praise. Amen. Give the Lord a praise. Thank he you, is Jesus. a healer. Thank Hallelujah. You, Thank, Thank you, you Jesus. Jesus. One more other testimony. If you don't think it's spectacular, you can still testify. <laughs> <laughs> oh, glory. Bless the Lord. Two awesome testimony. Wave Thank your hands you, and give Jesus. the Lord a Thank praise. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Two other ones that might not be spectacular too, or spectacular. <laughs> Amen. <laughs> praise the Lord.
Only one more sister. You finish is all right. Your sister, you're stand up. God bless you, sis. God bless you. Thank you, Jesus. Bless the Lord. This one is a spectacular one. Praise the Lord. Bless the Lord. Praise the Lord, everybody. Wave your hands and praise the Lord. Wave your hands and praise the Lord. Look where you brought me from. Mighty long way. Look back 20 years back. From 40 years, where we were. Look where you brought me from. Mighty long way. I said, look where you brought. Hallelujah. Yeah, a mighty, mighty long, long way. way. Oh, look mighty where you brought. Glory, hallelujah. Mighty long Thank way. you, Jesus. Glory to God. Testify. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus.
Hallelujah. Thank you. Thank you. Glory to God. So scarred with sin, but you did not despair. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Made it over again. Thank you. 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 Came back to you, a vessel Thank you, God. So unworthy, scarred with it. So scarred Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. But you did Thank you, Jesus. despair. You started over again. And I blessed the day he didn't throw. Hallelujah. Thank you, Thank Jesus. you Jesus. He is the potter. Hallelujah. And I am the clay. Molded in God's image. Jesus, he, he wants, wants to me to stay. Stumble and I fall. And my vessel may break. He just speaks up. The pieces he didn't throw the clay away over and over. He mold me and make me into his likeness. He fashioned. The clay, a vessel of honor. Thank you, Jesus. I am today. All because Jesus, He didn't throw the clay away. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. This song would mean much to you if your vessel Jesus, had been broken. Be broken. Right. If you have had a broken Thank vessel you, experience you, where Jesus. you have been battered and torn Thank out in the you, world. Jesus. Hallelujah. And Jesus stretched forth his hands as the potter and put your back together. This song would mean much to you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Testimony from this side. Hallelujah. Only two I'm going to take from this side. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. The teacher do the counting. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. A vessel of honor I am today. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Bless the Lord.
Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. 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 Praise God. Yes. Capture you. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus. Hallelujah. Yes, yes God. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Praise the Lord. Let's Thank praise the Lord, Lord for that Jesus. deliverance testimony. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Thank you Jesus. God. Praise God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. God is good. That's right. That's right. It's so true. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord, everybody. I'm giving the teacher a blight. Teacher Hamilton. Bless the Lord.
Thank you, Jesus. Glory. Hallelujah. Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Praise God. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Let's just stand and give the Lord a hallelujah praise. A hallelujah praise. If your hallelujah deserves to be to God, just give it to him. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. You're worthy of our praise. Let us give God some hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. We're just going to sing one song and then I hand over to Sister Donna. Mighty long way, Lord. Oh, mighty long way. If the Lord not bring you from mighty nowhere, you can sit. Mighty long way, Lord. Oh, mighty, mighty long way. way. Oh, mighty, mighty long way, Lord. Lord.
Thank, thank you. you, Jesus. Thank you, thank thank you, you. Jesus. Thank you, Hallelujah. Jesus. I can identify Hallelujah. with that song. My mother told me that I should have, the doctor said I, I wasn't to live past, I think it was age nine. Yes, you know how old I am today? I am 48 years old. At the end of this year, I'll be, fifth, I'll be 49. Mighty long way. Who could it be but Jesus? Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. At this time, without further ado, I'm going to invite Minister Vivian Howell and the Holy Ghost in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord, everybody. Let us stand to our feet and worship the King of Kings. Let us send up some praise and pressure the devil. Let us worship him. Oh, you're worthy to be praised. From the rising of the sun unto the going down. Hallelujah. Your name is worthy to be praised. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Praise God, praise God. You know that Brother Howell is not a good singer. But we have some good singers inside here. So there's a little song that dropped in my spirit a few minutes ago. And I'd like, if you know it, to put your voices together and help me sing this little song. Leave Babylon. Leave Babylon. Leave Babylon and come. Don't mind your friends. They will laugh you to scorn. When Christ was here, they had done him the very same. Look in your life and see how you live and leave Babylon and come. Oh, leave Babylon, Babylonian. Leave Babylon. Oh, leave Babylon and come. Don't mind your friends. They will laugh you to scorn When Christ was here They had done him the very same Look in your life And see how you live And live Babylon and come One more time Live Babylon The Christian Live Babylon Hear what people Give God Hallelujah, some praise. Jesus. Leave Babylon. Leave Babylon and come. Don't mind your friend. They will laugh you to scorn. When Christ was here, they have done him the very same. The Bible said we must work out our own salvation in fear and in trembling. So don't watch your friend. 
They will laugh you to scorn. But on that day, every one of us have to give an account for our deeds. I want to take time out to greet the Holy Spirit who is the head of my life. Greet our pastor and assistant pastor in their absence. And all the visitors that are here, I greet you all in the mighty name of Jesus. Saints of God, I greet you also in the name which is above every other name. It doesn't matter the honor, rebel, are the most excellent. The name Jesus is above all had a name. I greet my wife also in the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Could you stand with me one more time and turn your Bibles to the book of Isaiah chapter 1. We're going to read from verse 18 to 20. After which I ask Sister Makai to pray. Let us all stand for the reading of God's holy word. Isaiah 1 verse 18 to 20 said, Come now and let us reason together, saith the Lord. Though your sin be as scarlet, they shall be as white as snow. Though they be like Red like crimson, they shall be as whole. If he be willing and obedient, he shall heed the good of the land. But if he refuse and rebel, he shall be devoured with the sword. For the mouth of the Lord had spoken it. Minister Mackay. Praise God. You may be seated in Jesus' name. In the Gospel of St. Luke 15, from verse 11, the Bible speaks on a parable about a certain man of two sons. And the eldest went to his father and demands his portion. And the custom, the elders should get a portion of the father's inheritance before the youngest. But if you read the scripture carefully, the father didn't question the son. Why he want to leave home? Why he want to go on his own? But the Bible said, he divided his living and gave it to his youngest son. And the scripture said, not many days after, he took his journey to a far country. My subject this afternoon, come to yourself and change your position. Come to yourself and change your position. We don't know what that young man hear about the far country. But I think he must have heard something good. 
about the far country. He packed up and went to the far country. And there he had some good times with his friend. Because he had money, nice clothes, maybe some nice perfume, Sister Doris. So he get a lot of attention from his friends. But it comes a time when all that he had finished. The grass may look greener on the other side. But it doesn't mean that the other side is good. The scripture said, There is a way that seemeth right unto a man, but the hand thereof are the ways of death. Somebody that is in this congregation and those that are viewing online, I'm saying to you this afternoon, come to yourself and change your position. Isaiah chapter 1 verse 18 said, Come now and let us reason together, say the Lord. So this call is an urgent call. This call is speaking about the present. This call is not speaking about tomorrow, next year, but it's speaking about right now. While the blood is running warm in your vein, get salvation in your soul. Maybe you walk with God for five, ten years. But somewhere along the line, you drifted. God is saying to you, run, come. The Father wants to put you back together again. Do your sins. Hallelujah. Maybe you are scarlet. The Father said, come now. Not tomorrow. The Bible said, boast not thyself have tomorrow. For those know it not what that day will bring. You get five years old there, living it up. But the Father is saying to you, come now. We don't know about tomorrow, brother Simit. That's why the Father said, come now. And let us reason. He wants to have some dialogue with you. He wants to talk to you. Come now. Come to yourself, man. Look into yourself. And see if your life is matching up to God's requirement. And if your life is not matching up to God's requirement, God is saying to you to change your position. Where you are, you are in a wrong location. But God is saying, come. No. Come all ye that labor and heavy laden and I will give you rest. If you're tired of the life that you're living, God is saying, come. Change your position. Hallelujah. Now the word position means a place where someone or something is located. And all of us know our location. All of us know our position with God. And if you know that your position is not right with God, he said, come now. And let us reason. Though your sins may be as scarlet. No, scarlet is a red color. People can stay from far 
and seed. It doesn't matter how far you're gone in sin. God is saying, come. He has the power to deliver you. Come now. Now the word change means to make someone or something different. God wants to make a difference in your life. But all you have to do, be obedient to the word of God. This Bible said, if you be willing and be obedient, you will heed the good of the Lord. Hallelujah. But if you rebel, I'm a satyr, and refuse, hallelujah, you will be devoured with the sword. The sword is in his hand. Ready to cut. But he's given you a second chance. Our sister preached last week about the second episode. You have a second episode to face up to. But you have to make sure you set your house in order in the first episode. In order to enter into the second episode. The Bible said the rich man, leave it up, have a nice time in the first episode. Never remember God. But when the second episode stepped in, hallelujah, that rich man become a beggar. And the beggar was be comforted. I said, come now. I'm going to give a little demonstration. Brother Parks, you're in the back. Please stand, sir. And take all your belongings with you and come to the front. Don't leave nothing because you're not going back. Hallelujah. Right beside Brother Wright. Brother Parks was sitting at the back. But he changed his position at the command or at the invitation of the preacher. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Brother Duncan, you are the fire. Change your position and come. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Anyone, anyone, anyone. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Right beside Sister Darius here. Come. Right here. Right here. Right here. Now everyone can see that Brother Duncan change his position. Sister Duffus, take your things. Change your position and join us up here at the podium. Follow me carefully. Follow me carefully. All these three persons get an invitation to change their position and they were obedient in changing their position and that is all God is asking my sinner brethren my sinner friend to change your position you're in a world of sin you're in a world of darkness and God is calling you out of darkness into his marvelous light but all you have to do is to answer to the call. Be obedient to the word of God and change your position. Somebody lift your hand and praise God. That's all it takes. One step from sin to grace. 
Mercy Doer is still open. And while Mercy Doer is still open, God is saying, Come. You don't have to have no diploma to come. No doctorate to come. No PhD to come. You don't have to be a minister to come. All you need to do is to look into yourself and change your position. Hallelujah. Wave your hand and praise God. Wave your hand and praise God. Hallelujah. My viewers online, take these words seriously. Change your position. Change your location. God is saying to you, you're in a wrong location. The sword is in his hand. As the scripture said, the axe is at the tree root, ready to cut it down. But the dresser for the vineyard is saying, give it some more time. And let me see if it's going to bring some fruit. God is giving you another chance to change your position. Somebody lift your hand and praise God. Hallelujah. So that young man packed up. Went to a far country. Have some good time, Brother Campbell. But it comes a time when everything run out. Money finish, friend gone. And he leave alone. And the scripture said, he joined himself with a citizen of that country. And that citizen sent him into the field to feed swine. Remember, when he was at home, he didn't have to work, have everything to his disposal. Nice clothes, smell good, look good. Have servant to serve him. But because he packed up. Hallelujah. And leave a good table. You packed up. And you leave the church. You are the far country. I'm warning you. This may be your last warning. Come to yourself. And change your position. Come to yourself. I beg of you. Come to yourself. And change your position. So while he was. Tending to the swine. He began to eat. The swine food. As a Jew. I have no. Dealing with swine. You see, when you left God, what can happen to you? You find yourself in some company we never expect to be in because you leave God. But although you have turned your back upon Him, the Father is still looking out for you. The Father wants to put you back together again. But you have to come to yourself. So the Bible said, after fill his belly, Sister Sharon, with the swine food, him come to himself, Brother Simit. And he began to look back home and said, Look how many higher servants my father have. They have enough bread and bread to spare. And I'm out here. Perishing, heating from swine. And if anyone 
have any experience of dealing with pig, cow, goat, any animal. Over time, you smell like them. You will smell like them. No matter how your beard, you will still have a stench like them. There was a time I have five head of cow. And when I come in from Cobush, Sister Mackay, I have to get a little piece of cloth, Sister Duffus, with some cursing oil and put on my skin to get away ticks. So you will not only smell like them, but whatever they have, you will have it too. So if you're packed up and join a gambler, very soon you become a gambler. You start to beg somebody to buy it for you until the person says, Go buy it for yourself, no man. So you get accustomed to their lifestyle. But God is saying to somebody this afternoon, whether you're in the pig pen, whether you're with the cow, no matter the company that you're in, God is saying, come to yourself and change your position because I can put you back. I can fix you back together again. Wave your hand and praise God. The Bible goes on to say, when him come to himself, Hallelujah. Brother Campbell, him say, I will arise. Yes, I will arise. Yes, Not only come to yourself, yes, but arise. Yes, and said, I am going back home. Yes, I'm going to confess to my daddy. Father, I've sinned against heaven. I've sinned against you. No more worthy to call your son. Make me. You say what sin can do to you? Make you give up your sonship, your daughtership, and want to be a servant. Once you was in a position that you were serving. But by your cause you're packed up and leave God, you want to become a servant. But God said the sonship is still here for you. The daughtership is still here for you. All you need to do, come to yourself and change your location. And if you read the scripture carefully, all these years, or all these months, that he were in the far country. The father was looking out for him. Because the Bible said when the father see him. Yet a father. Hallelujah. He ran. To meet him. Did him alone to get a bad brother Camber. Because he must have smelled with the pig. But the father didn't give him a chance to say, go and get a bath. Because the blood of Jesus Christ can cleanse us from all unrighteousness. So the Bible said, when the father see, hallelujah, the father run towards him, hug him, kiss him, put ring on his finger, Married to him again. Put on a robe. I said, bring the best calf. I said, the best calf is here. And the father said, come let us make merry. For my son. That was lost. Now he's found. He was dead. But he's alive. And the Bible said they began to make merry. 
But while they began to make merry, Brother Camber, they held his son. Hear a sound. And when he inquired what was going on, and when he heard, he wasn't pleased. If the father can embrace him in the condition that he was in, who am I to scan him? We have to embrace them. Show them love. Show them that you care. Back in the days, I heard that when person backslide, they put them a back bench. But our pastor, our dear pastor, that gone home to be with the Lord, put them at the front. When you put them at back, you push them out back. But when you bring them to the front, you are showing them love. You are embracing them. Is there a backslider in the house today? You are online. God is saying to you, come now. For a long time, you have out there in the wilderness of sin, tossing to and fro. How they can make ends meet. But the God, the compassionate God, is saying, come now. It doesn't matter who is going to look on your funny. Come. Come to yourself. The young man said, I will arise and go to my father. And you see the demonstration of the three persons that I invite to change their position. They were in obedient to my invitation. And they changed their position. God is saying, all you need to do, be obedient. Be obedient to my invitation and change your position. Don't put it off and wait for tomorrow. Proverbs 29 in closing say, He that often reprove hardened his neck shall be cut up suddenly and without remedy you may not have no chance to say lord have mercy but why your blood is running warm in your vein salvation is at your disposal let everyone stand Come now. Not tomorrow. Right now. Whatever your condition is, are, God is saying to you, come. And come now. Don't put it off. You may not have the chance for our next message. You may not have the chance to hear our next message. Come now. Lead me, Lord. I will follow. Lead me, Lord. I will go. You have called me. I will answer, lead me, Lord, I will go. You are here without the Holy Ghost? Lead me, Lord. Come now. 
I will follow. Chrissy, change your position. Me, Lord, I will go. You have called me, and I will answer. One more time. Jesus. Me, Lord. I will follow. Lead me, Lord. I will go. You have called me, and I will answer. again leave me Lord I will follow we need some person to come and pray with these at the altar leave me Lord I will go you have called me and I will answer it again, lead me, Lord, I will follow, lead me, Lord, I will go, for you have called me, hallelujah, and, and I will
your people out of darkness into your marvelous light, Jesus. And we pray, God, that they will give heed, hallelujah, unto the call, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Blessed be thy name, Jesus. He is here, hallelujah. He is here, amen. He is here, holy, holy. I will bless his name again. He is here. Listen closely, hear him call in out your name. He is here, you can touch him, you will never be the same. He is here, hallelujah. He Amen. He is here. Holy, holy, I will bless his name again. He is here. Listen closely. Hear him calling out your name. He is here, you can touch him, you will never be the same. He is here, you can touch him, you will never be You don't have to leave here the same way that you came. God is here. And he's here to do something in each and every one of us life. He is calling you by your name. So you can easily identify the call. Because he's calling you by your name you don't have to leave the same way that you came you can touch him whatever your situation may be you can touch him and your life will never be the same if you want that change of life God is here to change your life he's ready and waiting to do something spectacular in your life all you need to do come to yourself and change your position you're gonna stand at this time everyone while you are able to stand on your feet you're gonna stand and close off in prayer let us all stand let us all stand Hallelujah. I'm going to ask Minister Rupert Campbell to close off in prayer in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Let's bow your heads everywhere as we close off in prayer. Lord God Almighty, the great God of heaven, Hallelujah. I spoke to us, your people, today. God, those that are walk away from thee and in a position, God, sinking them further. The word of God said to them today that they should change their position and come back to him. Is willing like that father. Oh, was waiting his eyes were all oh, like a sparrow waiting to see his son. 
And he did not wait now, God, until he reached at home. He ran and meet him and kissed him and hug him. Oh, for his son was walk away return. If there's a backslider in the house, God, oh, change your position and come back to God. And those, God, that are dear, never started. Run quickly, the time is hasting away. God, we thank you for your spoken word. We thank you for your ministering servant. I'm asking to strengthen him, Lord God Almighty. Oh, and give him a word that when he come again, he deliver it to your people. God Almighty, mention that the axe is lay at the root of the tree. God, read to you it down. But he's a, you are a merciful God, a merciful Savior. He's waiting and giving somebody another chance. Come quickly. Touch us, your people. Touch the singers who minister God Almighty today. And those who hear that word. Buried deep down in our heart, God Almighty, and bring it up back again like the cow that chew the corn, the grass, and swallow it back, and bring it up back again as it chew that cord. Oh God, come and walk with God. Bless us, God Almighty, as we dismiss this service this afternoon. God, go home with that word. Don't drop it. Keep it. Chew it. Swallow it. Bring it up back again. In the name of Jesus. Chew it. Hallelujah. Swallow it. Hallelujah. Bring it up back again. Like that call. That word is a lamp unto our feet and a light unto our part. Our guiding word. It is Jesus. Bless us as we shall go from here to a several place of abode. Take us safely home. Bless us continually, we pray, as we dismiss in Jesus' name. Let everybody say thanks. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Sister Donet. The Lord bless you all for coming out to service today.